right. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are in the world. This is Manolo, the Abundant Alchemist, here at Cypher Session, wrapping up the week for you guys, last week of January. I want to start off with LeBron James signing a partnership with Crypto.com. So this is all about teaching the children about crypto, blockchain, web 3.0 technology. Um, this mostly is going to be taking place, from what I understand, in Ohio, his hometown, where LeBron James Foundation is uh, established and working. Uh, on to other news. Played, which is a financial tech, has settled a class action lawsuit and agreed to pay $58 million to consumers with a linked bank account to any of its 5,000 client apps. This um, is for anybody who was part of using Plaid's um, services between January 1, 2013 and November 19, 2021. The reason for this is because more financial data that was needed from users was taken. And with that, I want to get into zero knowledge proof ZK Snarks. ZK Snarks is a way of verifying certain data that has to be used in order to verify the person is who they say they are without necessarily giving up all of that person's private information. Very interesting stuff that we'll be getting into this um, into in this channel. Uh, one of the protocols I personally am bullish on is Mina Protocol, which is one of the protocols using this technology. Uh, legal tender in Arizona, Senator Wendy Rogers in, has introduced a bill to make Bitcoin legal tender. With that, <laughs> which is very bullish news in my opinion because once politicians begin to realize that a lot of people will begin to rally behind them if they are the voice for crypto i think this is something that will be a domino effect especially since we're seeing countries um, begin to do this so we're super early uh, with that i want to touch on where we are Bitcoin is at 37,920. Uh, last I checked a couple of minutes ago, and Ethereum is at 2,600 this Sunday. Uh, I want to get into Bitcoin dominance. It has dipped uh, October 20, it was at 47%, uh, between 47 48% dominating the crypto market. It has fallen to 42.72%. And total market cap, all of the money um, multiplied by the amount of coins, uh, by the coins price, given a total market cap, excluding Bitcoin, it's down from $1.69 trillion November 10th to $962 billion as of this moment. Um, when I get into XRP, we are at a crucial uh, level of 60 cents. Uh, if it does not hold, we may face a correction to about the 30 cent level, which is something that I know a lot of XRP fans would be salivating over and will jump on that opportunity to purchase this asset, which is at the moment being uh, a bit haunted with this whole SEC case. A lot of things don't add up. It seems that the SEC has something to hide. Um, there's a lot of weird things. If you want to dig into it more, um, you could look into Forbes article, The Meaning of We at the SEC by Rosalind Layton. Uh, it speaks on William... Um, Hinnon, I believe, uh, that spoke in June 2018, stating that Ethereum was not a security. This now ties into this XRP case because XRP has been pushing for clarity, and it seems that the SEC is just kicking the can down the road. Maybe they have something 
to hide as the judge is asking for certain paperwork and they are just playing this type of game to lengthen the amount of time for this to continue on uh, without showing that paperwork that's being requested. Um, but I digress, you know, this along with um, Biden um, about to issue an executive order for regulatory, regulatory framework on digital assets all makes me think that something is brewing and we are going to reach some form of big conclusion. Uh, I think that's going to be in the favor of crypto, but anything could happen. So we just have to sit and wait. Wanted to bring you guys up to date in a short, brief video and uh, watch out for us. This Wednesday, we will be on the Dominican channel on YouTube. I believe it is Desacato. I'm sorry, I didn't prepare with that information. But guys, look out for it. We'll have, I'm sure, some information on that. Stay tuned. Check out our Instagram. Check our Twitters for that information. Peace.